Oi povo lindo, tudo bem com vocês? Hi everyone, it's Kelly here and in this video I'm been going over this month decor, the floating city set and some different design tips for your island if you are struggling to fill certain areas or you just need a little device on different combinations to give you some inspiration. I'm very excited to have the opportunity to set up this decor use only this month, set items and make sure you have what it takes to make your island a piece of Venice every time you open your game. I started by centering the grand prize, the heart of Venice, with the griffin pillar besides. Those are the symbols of Venice, so I'm gonna make sure they are centered and together. Right in front of them, I put the gliding gondola and the gathering gondolas along with it and then i included the canal crossing alternating with water pavement and with the venetian gardens and villas guys make sure to pay a lot to have a lot of coins to buy many of those two items the garden and the villas as many as possible they are amazingly beautiful and go with all the decors for sure Well, next I included the west and north little bridges and added some palms to give a vivid green contrast around the decor and added the guided tours guy. For me, uh, they need to be next to the gondolas for sure to look as much realistic as possible. But if you cannot afford the guided tour guy, you can replace it for one by one decor like the palm, the lemon tree, the fountain or the lamppost. After I added to my decor this cute refreshing fountain and to give some more colors, I included this totally Italian luscious lemon tree. It's so cute. Thanks, Wonka again. And then I added the pavement together with the lamppost and finishing up with some more pavements and a lot of waters. I mean, a lot of water because that's what Venice is about, the floating city steps of the two little items. Try to make three pieces of one by one decor with different shapes and colors to add some more interesting look to the area rather than if you put a two or four pieces together. I think the shape you can create with the three little items is aesthetically pleasing to look at so I wanted to show you the different shapes and colors of the step. Remember it doesn't need to be that big of a decor, but just make sure to use the items with harmony and most importantly, have fun. Of course, most of the players will mix all the decors with this month set and the possibilities are endless with different items. So don't be scared to use different items if you want to and just see what they're going to look like. I hope you guys liked this video and if you have any tips for me, I would love it to know about it, just leave in the comments below. I really appreciate you guys for watching it and I see you all around the community and thanks so much for being here. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe.